Nothing. Yeah. Perfect. Bring it on, holes. Are you as ready as I am? Let's do this. Why the hell are you in your pajamas? Wow. Not even that close to you. Can't you hassle someone else for a change? Fine. Now I'm not gonna keep you company. Let's go over here and play by myself. Uh, is that the bathroom? This is where you guys... You don't actually use that, right? Not having easy access to something like that would be the worst. I feel sorry for anyone who doesn't. What the heck, Arthur? Get off the crates. Cigarette card? I'm icy! I don't want the rum. Let me walk away. That's the first card I found? I thought I had more. Oh, wait. Where's Dutch? God, I really need to shave, though. Damn. I'm burly. Okay, Dutch, let's go f it up. A cigarette card. Not before I take this potent snake oil. Now the card. Cool. Oh, that's why. There's card sets. I totally spaced. Doesn't matter. There's way too many for me to ever find them. And if you did take the time to find them? <laughs> You're a trooper. I've had my fair share of ridiculous stuff I've done in other games. There you are. Working it all out. Once and for all, Arthur. Mm. What now? We're back. And I'm sitting here. And I am contemplating the great journey of the sun and considering a famous chess. I look disgusting. Those oily and actors of a mediocre justice, the Pinkertons, and their benefactor, the depressing millionaire, Leviticus Cornwall, they want us, Arthur. They want us. And they are going to have us. Maybe they ain't the problem. Meaning? I don't know. It's just, well, what's our move here? You sound like Hosea. What do you think? We can't stay here. That much is obvious. Where are we going to run to? I mean, they chased us from the west. They chased us over the mountains. They ran us into the sea. Arthur, do you have my back? Always, Dutch. But there's more than your back to worry about. We need more money. We've been on the run for months now. And I seen you killing folk in cold blood like you always told me not to. And I'm sorry, but I can't help but think that if we There is country in Roanoke Ridge past Butcher Creek. I believe we could hold. Okay. You and Charles, you can take folks up that way. I need time and no traitors. It's like he pointed into my soul. Let's go, Charles. Ride with me. Where are we headed? Up past Butcher Creek. It's Murphy Brute Country. That's why I'm asking you to ride with me. I understand. What are we doing there? We're looking for a place to hold up. Even the law won't follow us up there too willingly. Yeah. I did some scouting up there while you boys were away. And? You'll see. I don't even know what to think of that. Look at this Bronco. I want this one. I want the white one though. What did I eat? Oh, I ate my corned beef. I still have this thing on here? What are you doing? Another day. What are you doing? Hey, don't repeat me. So how did you find that spot back there? I assume the skulls on sticks weren't an addition of yours. <laughs> That's funny. Guess I just miss Hosea and his uh, wisdom, you know? Of course. I like that. That so didn't have to happen too. That was all Dutch's fault. Why did we have to rob that bank in that city again? There's the bridge. Who's this coward? Okay. <laughs> Who's this pussy? That's a good shot. And we're here. It's not much further now. So, I spent some time up this way while you were gone. Some men there spoke a lot about the Murphy gang that hides out in these caves. A place called Beaver Hollow. They're animals. Everyone is terrified of them. Just recently, a stagecoach from Annisburg disappeared without a trace coming through here. Great! Dutch didn't mention this. Well, hiding up here... It's not a crazy idea. This is a spot nobody comes near. Even the law. Follow me, stay quiet. Okay. Hold on, let me change my guns. Okay, let's go. 
Uh oh. I didn't mean to whistle. Shh. Go away. Go away, you. Stop following me. Well, I guess he's coming with us. Don't die. Nice. I do have a throwing knife. Oh, wait. The tomahawk. What are you waiting for? Nothing. Yeah. Perfect. Thanks. I like yours too. Okay. Let's see what's going on. That's a stagecoach we're missing. Jesus. They must be in the cave. All right. Let's get on with this. Okay. What do you think? We're gonna head into the cave or flush them out with dynamite. I have no idea what we should do. Uh. Let's surprise them in there. Okay. Let's get a little closer. I kind of wanted to see what was in the cave. Woo! In the entrance to the cave. You see it? Woo! Visitors, boys. Uh oh. Looks like it's on then, Charles. Damn it. How did I miss those? Hold on. I want my. I want my tomahawks. Hurry. Bring it on, holes. Are you as ready as I am? Let's do this. Why the hell are you in your pajamas? Come on, line up, girls. You're dead now, you piece of shit. Oh, am I? You couldn't even face me. What are you doing back there? You were wrong about these crazy sons of bitches. Nothing but degenerates down here. They have a lot of ginseng. What the hell do they use it for? How has no one else come to see if these guys are okay? We're coming! We're here! Let me reload a bit. Sorry. I think I'll just take my sweet time looting all these guys. I know, I know, I know, I know. I'll be right there. I'll be right there. I'll be right there. Don't you don't have to worry. What the hell do you think you're doing? How am I supposed to get in there? Just calm down. Oh. It's okay. It's okay. Shh. You're safe. It's okay. Miss. You okay to ride on my horse a little? I'll keep you safe. Annisburg, right? Yes. They... 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 they um... It's okay, miss. The others, they... They killed them. You're safe now. Just... Try to breathe. They're animals. <laughs> I know. <laughs> it's all right, miss. Why would they? <laughs> Some folks is just evil. Ain't no point trying to explain it. I haven't slept in days. I know. I would do anything to find more of them and just waste every last one. But for now, I have to get you home. Have I ever been here before? I really wish there was heroes like this in real life. Why don't we ever hear stuff like that? Mom! Meredith! She's alive! Oh, she's alive! She saw some pretty bad things, I'm afraid, man. Murphy group guys. Oh, my God. How did you manage uh, to? I just ran into them and found her. Oh, thank you. Here, let me give you this. Oh, that, that's okay, ma'am. You just keep her warm and keep her safe. <laughs> this is down. Oh, no. You leave me alone. You just leave me alone. Uh... Thanks, buddy. I'm glad that girl's safe. I know this is all fictional, but... Oh, George! Did you miss me? I found her drunk in San Denis. You're back. How jolly, Miss it's O'Shea. It's funny, you suck of shit. Back Who and you? drunk. The master, the Lord Molly. God, all my... Calm down. I won't be ignored. George Vanderlyn, I am in him. I ain't her. Or any of your stew 
Jake. Calm yourself. You don't owe me nothing. Miss. I don't owe you nothing. Nothing. Okay. I spit in your eye. I did. I told them. I'm sorry. Yeah, I told them, and I tell them again. Now I've got God's ear. You told who? What? Mr. Milton and Mr. Ross about the bank robbery, and I wanted them to kill you. You did what? I loved you, you goddamn bastard! Go on, She's shoot me! Crazy. She ain't worthy. <laughs> you told on me. Oh, you're you not betrayed so big now, me. What? Right. Calm down, Arthur. <laughs> She's a fool. Get her out of here. You know the rules. You're not so big now. Hurry, Your Majesty! You. What? Whoa. She knew the rules, Arthur. What the hell is wrong with you? Mr. Pearson, Mr. Williamson, get this body out of here and get it burnt. Okay. Now get back to work, all of you. Quit your lollygagging. Right. Get back to work. Yeah. Chapter 6. That was one hell of a f***ing ending. This game continues to amaze me constantly. Look, they're arguing about the murder. Hey look, a shave kit. It's about time. That's a lot better. There, I gave you all the stuff I'll never use. Holy crap, we're much further than I thought. I thought we were down here. Oh wait, yeah, that's right, we moved again. Okay, so either way, I have to go all the way back down here. I should have done that one first, huh? I'll just check out this bridge for the professor instead. Somebody's hurt. Oh, I see him down there. How did you fall for a bear trap right here? Is it just me, or does this guy look like Ted Roosevelt? Up with the pain, at least. Take this whiskey. Oh, oh, yeah. I have to steal the wagon? Does that mean I have to kill all of them? Uh, might as well. Okay, don't have much time. Let's go! Wow. And the moonshine is mine. Great, I still have to take it all the way over there, though. I just drifted this thing, did you see that? Come on, we gotta be getting close. I got your moon You're a wonderful man! <laughs> wonderful! <laughs> you got my money? It's, it's for a very good cause. Uh, my name is Professor Andrew Bell III. Perhaps you've heard of me. <laughs> Can't say that I have. <clears throat> oh, well, it is the most wonderful invention, friend. Oh, you, sir, have done a great deal. All deed. I've done is get some creep a lot of drink. <laughs> Creepers. Excellent. No nonsense. Now, you've helped me develop the most humane machine imaginable. A way to induce calmness to our most troubled souls. A way to end the barbarity of a public hanging. Oh, so, so humane. What are you talking about? The electric chair. Well, what? See, it's a chair full of electricity. It's quite fascinating. It calmly and peacefully dispatches the sinners uh, to face judgment. Yes, judgment. Yeah. Where mm. is it? Well, uh, it's in my laboratory. The next thing I need is a, a demonstration, a public one. Huh. Uh, do you know the police chief? Hmm? As well as anyone. Oh. My horse is in the way of this cutscene. You can encourage him to let me demonstrate the chair. That wasn't weird at all. Turns out I was helping him build an electric chair. I don't know how I feel about that. Anyways, I hope you all have a nice day. Thank you all for watching, and I'll see you in the next video. Peace. Choo-choo, motherfuckers.